this is such a beautiful time for you, Pisces. We've got like uh, right at the start of the week, Venus, Mars and Saturn all in the sign before yours. I mean, this is and like Saturn and Mars have very favorable sextile opportunity aspect with Mercury. Now, putting all this together, and Venus is going to be moving as well into your sign, so we'll come back to that. So let's put this sextile together. So Mercury is sitting in your uh, your solar second house. This is your monetary zone, okay? So in this area, um, it's really, it, you know, it's really good for you because the Mars and the Saturn that it's bouncing off are in your area of hopes, dreams, wishes, and goals. So, you know, it really helps you get in touch with, first of all, what you want your life to be like. And Mars, Mars gives you that like clarity, you know, it's like quick thinking alertness. And Saturn helps you sort of think longer term. Okay, well, this is good for now, but how is this going to look in like one year, two years, three years? And just, you know, helps you like think that longer term plan through and Mars helps you get in touch and think about what how that's going to look like in your life for now okay so you visualize you 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 know you're, you're such a great dreamer and i say this with affection because you know everything starts from a thought and then if we can put like the emotion and you know see what it looks like and the visualization on top of that which you're so good at doing I mean really you could run seminars on this I mean you want to teach this to all the other signs particularly all the earth signs you know gets it grounded but this is your secret to manifestation I mean you have that ability just to get excited about things and build it up within yourself and like visualize it and put passion to it and get excited about it you know it's so it's so wonderful um so in that sense this is a great time to do that and then as it's a couple of things that are going to happen then as uh, moves into your sign uh through this week say midweek early to midweek so Venus is, brings the love energy. It's romantic. I mean, so it's a beautiful in Pisces. So um, it's also fi about finances. So either way you look at that, love and money, it's both, you know, it's both good. Now, um, the other thing that's happening for you or coming up, it just heads up, like it, with Mercury in that, in that uh, monetary zone, right now you're likely to get news through be talking about you know money um managing your finances and so on keep in mind that this area of your chart is also about self-worth so you want to be careful of your inner talk okay um and just be conscious of what you're saying to yourself like and you know you have to be like notice it and be conscious about it because when we have those limiting inner thoughts that we keep saying to ourselves, we're hardly even conscious of it because we've been doing it for so long. We probably came from our childhood or earlier life or some, you know, situation or somebody told us something often enough that now we're believing it. Like, so you just go stop, okay, and change that thought, pivot to a new thought. But first of all, you have to notice it because you know if you don't notice it you can't do anything about it right okay so um so this is like a really really positive powerful week for you to step into your personal power and if you're you're interested in looking at a course to do that my self mastery program uh, jenniferangel.com under programs um gets excellent results in that way okay so as i said heads up like early next week mercury is going to move into your solar third house okay so once you get all that inner self-talk right then like next week you can then step out and start to talk to other people more and start to get organized and start to put things into action all right 
Okay, so I hope you have a great week. Thanks so much for watching. I love and vision to you. If you've enjoyed this video, please go ahead and share it. I've recently come back to YouTube and now I'm rebuilding my sub base. Okay, bye for now. Have a great week.